Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another Ipsy video. It's been like two months. Today features the December and January Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. Now, this is just an unboxing and talking about the products. There might be some products that will be featured in a get ready with me in the future, I don't know. But there is a lot of skincare and there's things that I'm just not ready to open at this time, so that's that. Before we jump into it, be sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel, haha. <laughs> For those of you that don't know, Ipsy is a monthly subscription service where you get five full-size beauty products sent to you. They're also coming up with other things, which I will get to later on in this video. Oh, I'm going to hit on what's called refreshments. And if you just want to like dabble a little bit, you can, for 12 bucks a month, you can get like five deluxe samples sent to you, sometimes full-size products. There's something called Glam Bag X, which sounds like the boxy charm like premium where it's just like a, a bigger box for like 10 bucks more. I'll hit on that a little bit later too. If you are interested to try Ipsy, my referral link is down below in the description box and I get points. Haha. <laughs> First, we're going to talk about the December products, the January products, and I'll touch quick on Glam Bag X and refreshments because I got little postcards for the January and then a quick I, I know I touched base a little bit on my in my boxy charm video but I just want to really hit on why I like Ipsy better. So I'm looking at my handy dandy app which I will insert right here the screen recordings of picking the products. Okay, so I have the Ipsy app open and flash sales are live now as it says for 48 hours blah blah blah. I need cleansers. I do know that. Pretty sweet, right? Obviously, like, notice the It Cosmetics Pure, blah, 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 and medium. Obviously, that would not be for me. They have these cute little bundles. Now we're down into nail polish. Coming into skincare. palettes and other like bundles that are bigger and whatnot. Oh wow, this is new. I haven't seen $24 bundles before. And yeah, so you just go to place order. I don't feel like sharing that shit. I don't like gifts. Anyway, so that's pretty freaking exciting. And that is the flash sale. Flash sale aside, you can actually go into shop all offers. These are things that are available every day and there's new deals that are added at nine in the morning each day. And they vary. And as you can see, when things are sold out, they are gray and they say sold out. Now, after a few days or whatever, um, these things at the bottom will actually disappear and new ones will show up at the top. So, that is the daily Ipsy offer. Ah, it's opening this time. So, this is what you see now the tool of skincare and this. These two things are what Ipsy picked for me. So now I can choose three items. So your first product. Oh wow, they're giving you five choices. Well, oh my goodness. How am I going to choose? <sighs> Might be a good idea to have a cleanser. I do need another spray. And, and this is what I get to see. So yesterday when they did my billing, I got to see the horrendous bag. 
And now that I've picked the products, you can scroll down through. Now when I'm reading information to you in my reviews, I open up the product, and you can see the value, the size, the type, what it does, how to use it, and right below you can see ingredients even. Um, oh, at some point you do get to see reviews, I think once people start getting them. And if that's something that you're interested in, let me know before like February 2nd. Oh, so let me know in like a couple days. <laughs> One of my five products is Tula Skin Care So Polished Exfoliating sugar scrub retailing at $32 it is a face scrub another exfoliator that's going to be put in the rotation made with natural sugar particles helps buff away excess oil and dead cells without stripping or irritating your skin packed with probiotics and superfoods like sugar pineapple and papaya to soften brighten and renew your complexion can we just like talk about how fucking weird this bag is it's like it's a really soft texture so like don't do drugs and you'll be fine i don't know what that means but it's fine the inside though is very i don't know it's like a weird gym bag but anyway that's going bye bye and next oh the verfi skincare 2020 eye cream I know it's not about the year, but you know, it's fine. This retails at 68 fucking dollars, Jesus tits. And again, I don't need an eye cream out right now, so this is going on backup. Do it all eye cream uses a, a cocktail of hydrating, firming, and brightening ingredients. Minimize dark circles, soften lines, blah, blah, blah. Vegan, cruelty free. So that's gonna be on backup. Another thing on backup is the go-to skincare. Fancy Face Nourishing Oil Cleanser. Retailing at $34. Oil cleanse, oil-based cleanser does more than just dissolve makeup, sunscreen, and buildup at the end of the day. Thanks to nourishing vitamin, antioxidants, and fatty acids, it leaves all skin types feeling soft, smooth, and supple. You apply three pumps into dry hands and ma massage onto dry face using circular mo motions, wipe clean with a warm washcloth. This like to dissolve, is this like a makeup remover? Lifts makeup oil sunscreen. Whisk away even long wear makeup. I might open this sooner just to see. That was a product that I picked, by the way. The other product that I picked, ha ha ha. This is the R Plus Co. Centerpiece All-in-One Elixir Spray, retailing at $32. Multitasking elixir spray hydrates, nourishes, and makes styling so easy. Packed with a sea buckthorn oil and hyaluronic acid to smooth strands, amp up shine, and fight frizz for set and and static for hours, which is why I which is why I picked this. So I will definitely be trying this sooner than later. That's not gonna go on backup, but I'm not I'm not doing anything else with my hair today. I'm like I'm fucking like leaving it alone. Like I don't know. It's fine. Real her I am amazing 24 hour eyeliner in black retailing at $16. Eyeliner pencil. But it's a twisty so you won't have to worry about this black eyeliner moving waterproof formula lasts for up to 24 hours seriously and the creamy <laughs> gel texture glides on incredibly smooth no tugging pulling or skipping g -g 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 -g. okay well i have i think i'll open this when one of my maybelline define a line eyeliners goes out well i still have the tartiest it's probably gonna be a while it's definitely on backup like whatever it's fine that was something that i picked which I'm wondering why I fucking picked that. It must have been like in a selection of like shitty choices maybe. Or we all know why because of the screen recording. I just don't remember because it's been fucking two months. Okay, this is an add-on. This is the Kenzie Life Beat Body Lotion. So with add-ons, they don't actually give you a full like retail value, especially for like a deluxe sample, which is what this is because this is only one fluid ounce. Skin softening, ultra moisturizing, delicious smelling, infused with hydrating ingredients, a blend of fruity and floral notes, juicy peach, coconut, citrus notes, but not overly sweet smelling. Magnolia and jasmine smell like just like walk through a luscious garden, whatever. Fuck your garden. Remember that saying? Like, I don't, I think this is probably from when I was in high school. So like it was a million years ago. Where did all my, sh where did all my shit go? Oh, another add on. But like, you know, like fuck your couch. What the hell is that from? But it's just like, fuck your garden. La la la. Oh, oh, I can just turn it. Moisturizing avocado and nourishing acai berry sheet mask set.
Cheat Mass Duo, infused with Good For You Superfoods, Double Your Glow, Avocado Mask, when you need to replenish, moisture, boost, elasticity, and strengthen your skin's protective barrier, make a date with the, the Akai, Berry Mask, when you want to improve your skin texture, aka tighten pores and smooth lines, yeah. cruelty free and vegan, and they are $3 each retailing, which is interesting because I just said the add-ons don't show fucking retail value. Which, okay, if you're gonna show fucking retail on one, why wouldn't you show it on the fucking rest? The rest of my goddamn case. Jesus fucking Christ. So the overall, what is this from? Like, what is this? I got this little, I think this came with, this is like a little like washclothy type thing that I think came with the, with the uh, cleanser. So the overall retail value of this I spent $25, okay, with the add-ons, which, and then the add-ons aren't included in the full retail value, so just ignore the add-ons, so like plus add-ons, okay. I realize that coronavirus plus holidays, that's why the December bag was so late. I had a lot of other shit going on to where it would have been a real big stretch for me to film around that time, so that's why I decided to wait. No hard feelings about that. Jumping, I know we're going a little bit out of order, but I'm gonna touch base on these two cards before jumping into January's products. Glam Bag X is what they're advertising for. So basically, if I signed up for Glam Bag X next month, my Glam Bag Plus would be replaced with this for like 10 bucks more. Eight full size products that you choose, and you choose three. I'm surprised you don't choose like four. Worth up to $428. Curated phase from celebrity makeup artist Patrick Ta. And then you get exclusive access to like Pat McGrath, Huda, which we've used, we've had Huda products before, so like. I don't, I don't know what else they're doing. Yeah, so they are advertising this. So, not sure if I'll ever do this. Like, I just ended BoxyCharm, but maybe, like, in the future if I wanted more, but I really don't need fucking more at this point. Something that's really interesting to me is the, what they're calling refreshments. Basically, an Ipsy exclusive where they curate an entire, like, skincare routine for you. Banish boring routines with our new membership to sparkling clean and face and, and body essentials. Member pricing starts at five dollars, twenty to thirty percent off MSRP. Clean and one hundred percent vegan ingredients, cruelty free, dermatologist tested, and you get on the list. So you can actually follow them at, at my refreshments. So there's more information there. So this is how it works. I'm going to screen record this. Okay. So how it works. Blink in your bathroom is stocked. Okay, sign up for the starter kit. We're well stocked for your routine, favorite essentials, blah, 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 and we'll add some everyday extras for you at a great value. You're in control. Use, use hand cream more, face wipes less. Update your recurring monthly orders by adding and removing or skipping products before we bill you on the last day of the month. Seems super easy. We'll ship every month in your glam bag, so, you know, basically free shipping, no strings attached. You need a break, you can skip products or cancel any time. I have no idea where that fucking stopped. Everything was going so smoothly. But now that we've talked about that, we're going to jump right into the January Ipsy Glam Bag. So first up is, I've had this brand before, the the, the Sela Cream Violet Soothing Hand and Body Butter. I had something else by this brand before and it was fucking awesome. Retailing at $28 body moisturizer is what they're calling it. Every time you slather this velvety cream, you treat your hands and body to intense moisture, relaxing lavender scent, whatever. The other thing that I had from that brand, I fucking blew through that shit. Like, I used it so fast. And a concealer that will be in a first impressions get ready with me. I don't know if you recognize this kind of color. There was a bronzer that I had from this brand, Item Beauty Air Hug Concealer in Fair and Neutral, retailing at $18. Redness breakouts in dark circles, this multitasking, totally lightweight, medium to full coverage concealer hides it all without ever creasing, caking, or fading. That's big words right there. Let's see how it goes in that first impressions at some point. Y'all, I gotta go through at least another fucking concealer before I open up another one. Okay, so this was one of my picks. This is the Gold Five an MD Mist RX Daily Nutrient Facial Mist retailing at $48 
dollars. Like a spray on multivitamin for your face, this mist re-energizes and revitalizes dull, tired skin with a blend of plant-based antioxidants and minerals. Together they help brighten your complexion, soothe inflammation, and protect your skin from pollution and blue light. Cool. All I got to say about fucking that, Jesus Christ. Why are you, why are you doing that? What the fuck? Now all of a sudden the fucking the whole interface of the Ipsy app looks different. Great, so fucking convenient. This is another pick. Butter skin, butter, butter. Okay, a cleanser. Retailing at $15. Not only does a face wash, remove makeup, cleanse skin, and purify pores, it sl slows away dead skin cells with, with exfoliating acids to reveal brighter, glow glowier complexion. Uh, use a soothing coconut oil and lavender extract to help condition the skin and calm inflammation. Again, this is gonna go on backup. Why not see that for another fucking year? Who the hell knows at this point? Which is why I, I really don't need refreshments right now just because I still have excess product from like BoxyCharm and if, if I ever like get caught up where I don't have like shit on backup, I'll probably consider that. Anyway, I have a primer, my YC Collection Let Me First Primer. This I have not used this brand before. Retailing at $15.99. Blurring primer, velvety texture, applies evenly, grips whatever makeup you layer on top for flawless all day wear, infused with a cocktail of active ingredients designed to refine your pores and minimize the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. Okay, so I have a few primers open. I'm not in a position right now to even open this right now, so this will also be in a first impressions. Get ready with me in the future. And yes, I am talking that fast. <laughs> I did not hit fast forward. This is all natural. That was a pick, by the way. And something that I'm having a debate on, like, opening this now or, like, saving it for summer, but, like, do I really want to be a hoarder? I don't know, but I fucking love using this shit. This is the Yensa Beauty Skin on Skin BC Foundation and Light Neutral. Why can we not get this in a fucking full size from y'all? Because I'm not ordering it from the Yensa site. I don't care. Not doing it. I want a fucking full size. Thank you. Okay. Deluxe sample. Let's see. Full coverage. SPF 40. Blah, blah, blah. Like, this has been on my channel before. I'm... I've used it a lot. I don't need to go into it. This is interesting. Some makeup wipes. Bliss Makeup Melt Oil-Free Makeup Wipes. Valued at $3. Packed with skin-loving ingredients like chamomile, marshmallow root, and aloe vera extract with an oil-free formula that's super effective at removing grime and makeup in one fell swoop. Well, we shall see, shall we? That was an add-on. The BC Foundation was an add-on, and the last product, which was also an add-on, and also giving me more reason to throw away a couple of my sponges, just because you really need to... I read somewhere, like, you should only use sponges for, like, a couple of months, and I'm like, dead month for over a year. <laughs> But the Farah Glam Sponge in red. I don't want, honestly, I kind of want to keep it, like, keep it sealed because I don't want it to, like, get dirty. I don't know. It's valued at $8. Uh, Latex-free sponge works seamlessly to blend your foundation, cream blushes, and even powders. Oh, don't get over fucking zealous. Like, unless you're baking. Like, well, I guess people do use it for powders. Like, I think I'm just talking out of my ass. I don't know. I know I already hit on why. I left BoxyCharm. There's so many good things with Ipsy. Like the amount of stuff that I have on backup and I'm able to try at the same time. If I were to just go to stores or go online and buy the amount of product, I don't even want to know what the fuck I'd be spending. You know, not all of us are in a position to spend, you know, 25 bucks a month or whatever. But, especially now with the freaking, you do have to be an, like an Ipsy member to do the refreshments. But even, so even if you did like the 12 bucks a month for like those deluxe samples, like why wouldn't you do the refreshments? You're gonna fucking save money to get damn good products. And I haven't even used the refreshment products. Like I have a lot of faith that they're gonna be really good. But like with the, with the other stuff, the add-ons, they have flash sales, there's bundles of stuff that you can get. And it doesn't even need to be for you. Like, if you like giving gifts, like, it's perfect. Stock, stock up. It's somebody's birthday. It's their unbirthday, which is basically, you know, the 364 other days of the year. Which is fine. Totally good reason to give gifts. It's a really good money saver. One of the biggest subscription boxes there are out there. And I can speak from experience that their customer service is the fucking best. Like seriously, shout out to all of the people that I've had to freak that have had to deal with me being confused as shit. Like I got 600 points one time because I didn't know how to read. True story. I just wanted to just do a random plug as to like why I'm so happy. There's lots of stuff. Anyway, I'm 
really excited. It's really overwhelming to do two fucking unboxings in one video. I have not done that since like February, March 2019. And that was before the Glam Bag Plus. Freaking information overload. By the way, the January retailing for this amount, sorry that it's like I'm so fucking ADD. Is it really that surprising? Well, we are here at the end of this video, finally. Hopefully when we're back here in February, it's just February and not in February and March or something. Where it would be not February but March too? What? I don't know what I'm saying. It's fine. And anyway, I thank you so much for watching this video. Sorry that this was a long one for Ipsy, but here we are and here we go. I'm leaving. That's why. <laughs> Be sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and until the next one.